Okay, you guys, what we're going to do is we're going to add some green leaf to the back of this thing. So, what I'm thinking is we attach it. Because you can go in like this. Right? It's still there. So, I'm attaching this from the back onto the base grapevine base but I want I'm doing it on the up more on the outside so that we can build on this wreath right so if everything goes onto the outside Guys, I'm getting all mixed up. Oh. So I think this garland is like a nine foot garland, I believe. So I'm just gonna attach him in here. So we need to get him incorporated here so we can, we can do this. Okay, now the tricky part is to get... So now, we're going to try and incorporate this in with the rest of this one. So that when we go and put our um, mesh on, we can intertwine it and use these to tie, tie the mesh on, right? See, like this one here, we can get that into here. Which is, you see what I mean, right? Get those in there. That way you can use it. squeeze him you can still have some that, to widen it a little bit right but I want to get him in here there, that, there we go now this side I think this might work I had got I thought of this the other day because I want it because the back is, is a grapevine um, it's like a half a moon right I thought, hmm. So you can just pull everything in and then we can attach the mesh onto this. And hopefully we can get it have it nice and full so that when you put the scarecrow on, it looks amazing. That's what we want, right? We want it to look amazing. So you're just kind of like stretching it, uh, expanding it, like or not expanding, can't get the right words out of my mouth. You're fluffing it like you would if you were to do a garland on the garland, right? But see, I've got two garlands. I've got this guy in the middle on top of the, the base. Okay, now we need to get this guy somewhere somehow and get him in here. Oh my goodness, you guys. This might actually work. So I think what I'll have, this is the top. I think I'm going to have that as the top and that as the bottom. 
So bear with me before I, I want to I got in a second. I, I just I found it in one of my boxes. So I'm gonna leave I have to go with the red, but I'm going to try something because I want to have it in the middle, right? But I want to see if I can intertwine it. I don't know if you can see the bottom here. So I was thinking maybe if I can get it in here. There you go. Right? So I got one there. And it's hiding inside. Kinda. Okay, and then I take this. I'm just gonna. So you gotta cross them, then you can pull them through and twist them, right? So I'm trying to grab one from each side. Okay. Hope this works, guys. Hope this works. Because now I might be able to put a tail on the bottom. I have it, the red one. Aha. This one looks so cool. This next one. Got my peoples. Oh, there's one right there. Uh, this one. Oh, one. Oh, this one's perfect. And Even though I got small hands, it's still hard to do. Okay, I'm gonna try that. Okay. So this guy. Where are you guys up? Ah, uh, easy. We're doing curls. Right? And I already got these. I have. Four of those, we gotta try and put those in. Okay. So that's. Oh, this might work. Right. Like that. Like this. Look at that. Perfect. I don't know. The pink kind of comes, pops out. Now we're at the top. I think at the top here, I would like to have, yeah. hmm, I might want those up here. We can do that. I was just trying to make them kind of even, but I guess it doesn't really matter.